Hi everybody, David here from Living Tech. Thanks for joining me. A company called BNR Innovations out of New York recently sent to us their X-Rack product for review. The X-Rack is a hitch-mounted cargo carrier designed specifically for the Tesla Model X. Accessories were also sent, including two mini cargo bags, one big cargo bag, a cargo cover, all of these waterproof, a fishing rod holder, license plate mounting hardware, combination wrench, tie down straps, you name it. What I'm doing here is I'm uh, giving you the last part first, which is my review and my opinion on this product. And if you like it, then you can spend the time watching the unboxing and or the setup uh, and installation of the product. So if I had to come up with a succinct review of this, I'd say that it's convenient and it's efficient. By convenient, I mean that the rack collapses down and fits perfectly into the bottom of the trunk of your Model X. It can also sit on the top of the back of the trunk where uh, you have the carpet covered uh, board, I guess that's, that's there by default. Um, I like insetting it into the bottom because you can still use the, that part of the trunk for groceries or whatever, uh, whatever you wanna carry and it's just sort of hiding down there for the next time you need it. And to me, that's uh, perfectly efficient. Then when you wanna take it out, you pull it out, the hitch receiver actually slides into the, to the box channel tubing, whatever you call it, uh, right in the rack. So there's no extra part you have to remember to bring the, the two bolts to, to uh, sort of extend it and hold it in that extended position they're integrated right into that uh, as well. So they are always with you. So as long as you have a wrench handy, uh, I just throw that in the very bottom of that uh, compartment. As long as you have that wrench handy, then you're ready to go anytime. So it's super convenient. And the other uh, aspect to me is efficiency. The cargo bags are perfectly sized for that lower back uh, trunk portion which means uh, we just went on an 18 hour trip each way down to the States and back. And all I did was bring those bags into the house. We packed them up full, brought them in and brought them out to the car and literally just dropped them in because they fit perfectly. If the bag fits, then, then all your stuff fits in. And so you, you drop it into the back and then you put that cover back on. If somebody's looking at the car, it looks like it's empty at the back. And meanwhile, you've got uh, in our case, two months worth of clothing uh, fit into the back perfectly with no wasted space, right? Because the, because the bags are that uh, is exactly as big as the back compartment. Now there's also a big duffel bag and we chose to put that on the back rack, but the two mini bags together are the same size as that big bag. So you could just throw that big bag into that uh, back trunk compartment as well. Uh, and you could have the little bags on the on the rack. So it's it's sort of configurable that way. Everything's waterproof. There's a cover. It wasn't really meant to be used the way I used it, but I decided to put the cover on top of the large cargo bag. It's the same size roughly. And um, the the company said, yeah, in fact, that's uh, that that's a good idea what you did. So so I was happy with that. I, I, I got the tie down straps with it, as I said. And uh, anyway, the, the whole thing worked out perfectly for me and we really appreciated it. It was a long trip. We really appreciated having uh, this extra space uh, inside the vehicle. When you look at the pictures of the car, it doesn't look like it makes that big a difference, but not only did we off, offset, well, I mean, essentially it's the size of that back bottom compartment again and, uh, and, and packed full. So. Uh, so it was a noticeable difference that having this made on our trip and uh, we loved it. Not only did it give us space, it was super easy to deploy and everything in the products seemed better than you would think that they would be. They, it seems like they thought of everything. So we're absolutely thrilled with this product. I uh, can't recommend it highly enough. So if you think you might be interested in a product like this, then you can stick around and watch the unboxing and then the setup. And hopefully that answers any questions you might have. If it doesn't, just leave a question in the comments below and I will get back to you. If you like this video, please click like. 
Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to see future videos like it, and we'll see you in a second. Okay, so very nicely packed, lots of uh, plastic and foam, straps, there's a cotter pin on this latch here, and we're looking at it upside down of course. Uh, it looks like it screws in, it's got a lock washer, uh, so it stays in, and then this goes in for extra protection, which is great. Two straps. It's welded, powder coat painted. Nice. It's pretty light duty. The uh, the weight, like I said, this is the lightest version, uh, but it feels uh, strong at the same time. You know, it's not going anywhere. Denny cooler look. Mountain point. Oh, that's cool. It's uh, there's a picture of a cooler here, and it shows you exactly where to mount said cooler. So that that is cool. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna, oh, so there are arrows and there are uh, sort of instructions. So Thule Snowpack Ski and Snowboard Carrier Mount. So it's uh, made for that. Denny Cooler Lock Mounting Point. Uh, license Plate Mount. Rear Accessory Port for x rack Add-on Accessories is here. It says don't put a bike rack or a trailer in this hitch part. So that's sort of common sense. Mounting hole for x rack fishing rod holder. This is, I like this, this is super nice because they, uh, instead of having to look at the instructions, they make it idiot proof. So that's really cool. Um, oh, the, these are the, uh, the stickers and the arrows. That's for the cooler. And that's for the Thule um, snowpack, ski and snowboard carrier. Um, let me show this to you here. Hopefully you can see from this angle. I mean, there are going to be other opportunities to see this, but uh, oh, there are two, um, two sort of uh, pins here that are actually, I guess. So I guess it's threaded on this side, hence the lock washer, and then the uh, cotter pins. So two of those, and uh, it's got this cool, uh, it's got this cool X-Rack logo. Um, this is super nice so far. Uh, it looks like there, these. This is riveted. The the platform is riveted to the um, to the metal below it, which is nice. Uh, everything looks high quality. Um, I'm not sure if the rivets are stainless or not. Don't know how that works, but uh, anyway, yeah. So super high quality. You sort of have to to. Um, feel it but what it feels like um, it feels strong but it feels light at the same time so that's really nice uh, so we're gonna put this aside for a second ah this is a wrench this is actually a nice uh, nice, nice little wrench and there's one other thing in here fishing rod holder uh, hardware here that's neat. It's got like rubberized uh, uh, insert here. There's there's sort of a notch in this tube, and uh, I guess where the reel goes onto the rod, and then it's got rubber, so it doesn't uh, it doesn't scratch your fishing rod. That's pretty cool. I just want to see what it looked like. Here's uh, the first of the cargo bags. Yeah, the zipper seems like it's waterproof and then it has this flap over the top. So as long as the material doesn't leak, which of course it won't, it's like a, uh, it's a synthetic material of some sort. Super nice. All right, let's uh, get to the next one. This is the cover, the waterproof cover for the, for the bags. I'm not sure if it's for the bags only or for anything. Again, nice, uh, nice extract logo. It looks super well done. Ten tie down points. 
I have a feeling these aren't going anywhere in a good way. These are the smaller mini cargo bags. Oh, and it comes with its own straps. And, oh, this comes with shoulder straps. Very nice. what I'm seeing here. You can't probably tell from uh, this video so far, but the material is, it's super nice. <laughs> um, it feels like a synthetic, uh, like a high quality raincoat or something, but the thicker. The idea is two of these will fit side by side on the X-Rack, or you could have the bigger one. Whether you choose the big one or the two small ones, uh, you can put the cargo cover over them.